to YouTube. It's your girl, Miss Lady, and you're now officially in tune to I Ready TV. Well, I'm giving you everything I got. Beauty tips and music, y'all ready to play. Some of y'all like, bitch, where you been? All right. I did a break for a second. Just a lot going on, like putting my mixtape together and all of that and work and anywho, just had a lot going on. But um, I was coming to update you guys on my um, Victoria hair and how that was holding up. The hair that I overprocessed, you guys know I had the Brazilian wavy before that I overprocessed. Um, I have the video link below of that hair. And I had that in for like two weeks and it, you know, it was doing good, still a little dry. I'm still working on getting the dryness, you know, fixed from what I did to it. But she was having a back to school sale and actually ran out of the Brazilian wavy because she was gonna send me three more bundles. So she decided to send me um, three bundles of Malaysian curly. So um hella excited. I've never had Malaysian hair before. I never really had curly hair before. I had Brazilian deep wave, but curly is kind of a little different. So um, I'm going to come show you guys the hair. Um, and it's Malaysian curly. The curl pattern is really, really pretty. I just think the curl is so pretty. Um, I'm trying to like feel the difference in Brazilian and Malaysian and Indian, like what makes them so different. Um, of course, it's not as like coarse as Brazilian hair is, but still, I don't know. All feels like hair to me. But anywho, this is the inches that I got were a 22, a 20, and a 16. So this is my 22. And it's straight out of the package, you guys. I haven't wash it, I haven't done anything, anything. I'm about to color it, um, which will be later in this video. I'll show you me coloring the hair. Um, but yeah, so this is the 22, and you know you're supposed to measure the hair while it's straightened, so I'm going to just get a curl and straighten it out. And it comes to like the middle of my stomach, which is pretty much where 22 does fall on me, so this is a 22. Well, without stretch, it falls like right up the, underneath my boob right here. So that's the 22. And this is the 20. It falls to like my ribs right here. So it falls like a 20 when it's straightened. Um, when it's curly, it's just right on top of my boobs here. Um, and then the 16. When it's straightened, it comes to my boobs. So, and then it's not, it comes here. So, um, I'm probably with this hair, I'm going to bleach it. I wanted to lighten it with the developer, but I'm scared because of what I did last time for my other hair that I don't, that I don't even want to do that. I'm just going to go ahead and put some bleach on it. Um, it'll probably loosen up the curls a little bit, which I really don't mind because um, it'll make the curls look a little longer. So, um, I'm going to bleach this with BW Bleach and 30 Developer. And once it gets to the bronze color that I wear, I wash it off. A lot of people ask me how long that I do I have it on for. I really don't have it on long. Like, I don't count. I kind of just eyeball it. So I see how long it's, like, you know, the color. As long as it look right, I don't really know how long it takes. Because some hair pulls a lot faster than the other hair. Some pulls a lot slower. So it really just depends. Um, I'm going to try to open one of these so you can guys can see it. It has a little tie band thing around it and then it has a rubber band around it as well. Did just rip some hair off doing that. No biggie. But um but there you go. I don't want to really run my hands through the curls too much. Not getting any shedding though. So about five strands. Nothing big, you know what I'm saying? With curly hair, curly hair does shed um, a lot more anyways, but um, I'm going to seal my whip anyways. So, yeah, this is how it looks. I'm going to see, I think like all her webs have a trouble area on them.
Okay, so trying to wrap this video up. So this is pretty much how my color came out. Um, it's still kind of damp right now. Um, there's some places that are still really dark, which, I mean, I guess I don't mind it because, you know, with it being the fall, you kind of like want low light. So there's like low and high and some that are perfect. This is actually my 16 inch. So, I mean, I think the curls did loosen up a tiny bit. Not a lot, though. A little bit. But either way, I like it this way because now I look kind of longer. <laughs> so this is my 22 and this is my 20. And this is my 16. So, they're still like really like damp, like real wet still kind of. But as you can see, the hair is curly. It still has a nice curl to it. Um, once I install the hair, I'll be able to actually like define the curls. Um, all I did after I bleached the hair, after I washed it out, I used the Tresemme Luxurious Moisture to shampoo and condition the hair. And then I used the um, olive oil hair mayonnaise to deep condition the hair. And then I put like some argan oil on it while it was wet and then let it dry, well, letting it dry. So that's what it's doing right now. Um, I'm probably going to sail the wet tonight and then tomorrow I'll probably install the hair so this is just going to be like a first look and color video on the hair and then the next video is going to be how I install um, style and give you guys a like initial review on the hair um, so that'll be the next video so thanks again for watching and I'm out of here sorry I'm so drained I was just really tired I just got done doing hair and I got work in the morning so I'm trying to get all this stuff done but Thanks for watching and I'm out of here.